Hey there, it's Jay once again with reviews of mobile games from Mob.org. In today's episode, anime battles, classic tower defense, a greedy plush mustachioed egg, car repairs, animal fights, and scooter driving. So let's go! The first game for today is an anime tower defense game called Arrow Wars 2. This is a kind of game where the main role in your defense belongs to the hero rather than mobs, just like in Dota. There's even some kind of a plot here about three tribes and an evil twin brother, but you'll have to look at it on your own since I'm more interested in the graphics. The game is amazingly bright. It has almost lurid colors, but at the same time they remain within a cartoony style and your eyes don't hurt too much. The art style is cartoony as well with a bit of anime, and the cutscenes have plenty of girls with big boobs. So if you're still in doubt whether to play this or not, just remember. Big boobies! The second game is called Epic Defense Origins. This is the same genre as the previous game, but the execution here is much more classic, and I'm not even talking about old sprite graphics games, although it is true here. I'm talking about the gameplay. You need to place and upgrade towers to prevent waves of mobs from going all the way to the end of the row, and destroy them along the way. In short, a classic from head to toe. The only thing that has a bit of a novelty vibe is upgrading towers with crystals. You stick three red ones into your tower and it burns with flames. You fill it up with blue ones to strike with ice. You can combine the crystals to get interesting variations. Number three is a platformer called Leo's Fortune. And yes, the main hero is a mustachioed plush egg collecting coins. The game has quite a decent amount of long, eventful, and well-designed levels with beautiful graphics and excellent music. Levels are divided into, uh, let's call them chapters. If you beat the entire chapter well, you'll open its bonus levels. Well means three stars, and we all know what that takes. The main hero and his abilities deserve special attention. He can inflate like a balloon or shrink, becoming heavier. In general, these are the properties most puzzles are built around. Cool game, and in my opinion, you have to play it. Let's go to the next one. Car Mechanic Simulator 2014 is, as you could have guessed by the name, My Dear Holmes is a mechanic simulator, which is quite strange but interesting. We're used to driving cars and smacking them into walls, but we have no idea how to repair them. The game has three types of cars, sports car, family car, and minivan, and they're all certainly broken. Of course, this simulator is not as detailed as a real vehicle, so you, having played it for a while, could not secretly take apart your dad's car and then reassemble it, but you still get a general idea of what's happening in the bowels of your car. So if that's something that you like, go ahead and play it! Next game's called Animus Online. No, it is not an MMO, as you might think. This is only a co-op oriented hack and slash RPG like Diablo 3, but of course much simpler. The idea is that this animal kingdom was attacked by nasty humans, now you have to fight them back. The game graphics are pretty good, though a bit simplistic. There are three classes that you can level up, and of course there's the co-op. You can play with your Facebook friends, and if you're forever alone and have no friends, the game will take pity on you and let you play with friendly AI. The gameplay is pretty nice and convenient, so why not check it out? And the last game for today, Fast Moto Crazy Ride 3D. This is a runner where we drive a scooter with oriental music playing in the background. Basically, if you don't count the oriental music in the scooter, this is a typical runner. The road gives it a bit of a twist, but it's nothing striking or epic. Avoid crashing into buses and garbage trucks, jump over passenger cars, and the game has no chance. And for some reason, this simplicity makes it a decent time killer. Well, that's all for today. Don't forget to like stuff, comment, and subscribe to the channel. This was Jay with reviews from Mob.org. See you!